Stakeholders Democracy Network, SDN, the River State Ministry of Youth Development, have launched a comprehensive youth development policy focusing on inclusivity, accountability, and good governance. The policy covers key areas like ICT, agriculture, and the creative industry, aiming to harness young people's skills and promote development and wealth creation. The policy was handed over during a handover ceremony in Port Harcourt. That we would not just end up having a youth policy in the state and it's not going to be left on the shelf. We believe that it would also speak, you know, to every youth. This policy would find full expression in the life of every youth um, in the area of growth and development. Good thing and inspiring thing for us about this policy is that it has explored key thematic areas. ICT is the new oil. It's also has explored um, agriculture, um, the creative industry, and we believe that when all of these thematic areas are being considered during the implementation of this policy, it will provide opportunity for young people's skills to be unnessed, and they also will work towards their own wealth creation and their own um, development overall. We know how policies are in Nigeria, how that is okay, it's easy to develop, to develop policies, but like she said, we want this policy to be implemented because it covers almost everything that every youth needs to get to the next level in life. And we are sure, confident in what the, the commissioner stands for and what the executive governor stands for, that this policy will not remain in the shelf. It will be one of the um, shopping documents that will be used to harness and increase you know, the welfare of youth in the state. Responding, the Dr. Chisum Bali lauded the new youth development plan as a game changer for the state. Dr. Chisum Bali praised the new youth development plan as a game changer for the state, empowering 80% of its 8 million residents. He emphasized that previous administrations struggled to provide direction for youth development and assured the governor of its potential impact. This game changer, this preparedness plan from planning for the youth to planning with the youth. This is actually what we have been craving for. This is actually what we have been yearning for. This is actually what uh, the youths of River States and even other states would need at this very precarious time. A direction policy, a direction program that will uh, guide activities, program and policies of states. This is a compass. In fact, for me, as a commissioner for youth development in River State, at this very auspicious time, this is one of our greatest achievements. And so I want to thank Stakeholder Democracy Network, um, a civil society organization that is standing out. I think this is the best of its kind. I've never seen a CSO do this kind of thing to any state. For me, I stand to be corrected. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.